like in the cramps because one for five he's got and there's a boundary it's nicely played by Tacta he's off the mark with four and that fine leg fielder has definitely got to go square up he's got a left arm bowler swinging the ball back into a right hander the ball's not going to go that fine he's got to go squarer but how nicely has this been played by Harry Tector? Using the pace of the ball. It's a lovely shot from Tector. We really have seen him grow up before our eyes over the last couple of years. The World Cup Super League did him a power of good. And that really is a terrific stroke of his pads. Yeah, second boundary, and it's a similar shot. Carver copy, leg side flick. And again, I'll just mention the balance. It's a poor ball. Most batters, even yourself, Brian, will put that away most days of the week. But That's nice. A little bit of width. Carves it away square on the offside for four. Tech to dealing in boundaries at the moment. That's three for him. Yeah, he gets served a wide half volley. It's a hit-me ball, really. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Yeah, yeah, would have been a Lovely timing, good hands. Piercing that square point region. And you'll get four more there. Did well to reach it, actually, in the end. It probably would have been a wide, but he got a thick enough part of the bat on it to send it racing away. A bizarre ball, really, isn't it? Similar ball last over the Harry Tector hit square through the point region. For a bowler that's had the ball under such good control all innings, 5.4 overs. A gift for Harry Tector. It was fast, it was flat, it was short. And Tector said, Thank you very much. This is what Ireland have got to do with the young man. They've got to try and get on top of him early. He'll be nervous, of course he will. That'll do. That's a great shot, loose ball. And smashed for a boundary. He's been cashing on the loose balls, not sparing anyone. Yeah, with given. And of course, just uh, one of those along the ground. It's going to get damp again. 50 up for Tector. That's his 12th one international 50. His first, first against Afghanistan. He also has kicked on and got 400s. And I need that today. He's played beautifully. With all this target of 310, he's been so superb. I think he has decided that's the case. He's a good player, he can do it. One bounce and that's gone for four. Two boundaries in a row. Tossing up. Smashed down the ground. A confidence stroke from Texas after getting to his half century. He's trying to express himself. Well, oh, not ball particularly well today. He's now getting a bit of a treatment as well. Connection, nicely played. A couple of bounces, and that goes for four. That's a good start to the over. Well, kicking the length early. Also with the previous one, looking to exercise pressure on the bowler straight away. Nicely connected. He calls for two. He's going to come back. This is the moment for Harry Tector. It's a fifth one day international century for the man who is setting new levels with the bat for Ireland. He can add Afghanistan to a list of New Zealand, Bangladesh and Zimbabwe. It's been as good as any of them. Look at those numbers, a career average over 50. As good as maybe we've ever seen in the green of Ireland. Free hit, long handle. Leg side, six. 
Well, he's hurt himself here, Harry Tector, or else he's got a bit of cramp, I think. Been out there for a long time. He was cramping after coming back for the second to get us. Don't worry about running, Harry. Fours and sixes will do. I tell you what, the Afghanistan fans won't be liking the cramps because all of a sudden they might remember Glenn Maxwell. In a lot of cramps, yet he chased down that target after having lost so many wickets early on. Yeah, he looks in pain. Harry Tector goes down and sweeps this beautifully for a maximum. Just that we were talking about how he'll be picked up. He shovels across and smashes this for a maximum. Yeah, flat. Goes across the stumps. Previous two balls stayed leg side. Harry Tector this side. This time gets across the stumps and a flat bat. Fruki. Reverse from Harry Tector. What a lovely shot that is. Why not? Have a bit of fun. You've played out of your skin. It's all on your shoulders now, Harry Tector. And clever as well, because he knows Fruki's going to go for that Yorker, so he just brings out the reverse ramp. It's, it's, it's stylish, I tell you. It's so beautiful. 